now, here are your latest headlines and updated Kansas City forecast from KSHB 41 News. I'm Dia Wall with KSHB 41. Here are your headlines for Tuesday, October 26th. FDA advisors now endorse Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine for kids 5 to 11 years old. A panel met on Tuesday and voted to approve the drug maker shot, which contains a third of the dosage compared to an adult vaccine. Officials say it could be available in early November if the CDC votes for approval during its meeting starting November 2nd. A Marine veteran from Kansas City pleaded guilty today for his involvement in the January 6th riots at the U.S. Capitol. Kerry Walden admitted to climbing a wall and entering the building after attending a rally by Donald Trump. His sentencing is scheduled for January. Kansas City's National Women's Soccer League is getting its own stadium. Team Oders plan to build this $70 million field along the Berkeley Riverfront, expecting to hold as many as 11,000 fans. The stadium is set to open in 2024. This development is just the latest for the team. Kansas City NWSL recently announced a new $15 million training facility in Riverside. Here's Chief Meteorologist Gary Lezak. Wow, looking forward to that. Very interesting weather pattern. Lots of rain in our forecast. Anywhere from one inch to maybe four inches of rain, more likely two to four inches widespread. As you see, these rainfall amounts just add up. Forecast for tomorrow, 55 degrees in the morning, in the 50s all day. The chance of rain will increase to 100% by around noon, so it may take a little while before it to get started. But once it starts, it rains for a while off and on through Friday morning, and then maybe rain or snow Monday night or Tuesday. So we'll work on that one. 30% chance means there's a 70% chance it won't happen, right? Right? All right, uh, there's your forecast. Remember to get your news and weather anytime at kshp.com.